Hi, I'm Tom Bowers. And I'm Matt Meldrum. And we are Sons of Nothing, and we're here to talk about some of the tracks on our new album, Almost Paradigm. And finally, we come to our last track, which I think, paradoxically, was the first track. This, <laughs> I think this <laughs> yeah, was the first was. song that was actually finished. Yeah, it was. It was finished a long time ago, actually, and released as a single, if I recall correctly, too. It was, we, I think we, it was first played live in 2012, and then released as a single in 2013. Wow. It, uh, it's, it's been around the block. Yeah. Uh, the song is called Evolution, and Matt wrote it his very own self, so I think he should talk about it. I did. The music has been around for a long time. It was just a little musical thing I liked to keep playing around and around and never had any words, never thought it was going to have any words, never thought it was going to really become anything until my second son was born. Uh, and when he came out of the hospital and got cleaned up, he looked exactly like me, which just scared the crap out of me. You know, I'm sure there are some parents that think, yes, I have my minion now. Yeah, my, my, my mini-me. Mini yeah. Uh, but that was not my reaction. My re reaction was an immediate fear of, man, if this kid looks like me, is he going to act like me? Is he going to turn out like me? And I didn't want him to. I want my children, my progeny, to be better than I am. And this is certainly just, obviously, some of the most personal lyrics I've ever written are all over this particular record and this song. Mm -hmm. Uh, and it's just an ode to that not happening. Uh, hope that I can do something to put him on a path that will make him a better person. And it's a, it's a beautiful melody, and I was uh, really, it, when it was done, I, I just listened to it and said, I don't know what you want me to do. I think it's, I think it's finished. There's some, I, I, don't, I, don't even, I wasn't even sure if it should be a Sons of Nothing song, other than the fact that I really loved it and wanted it. Uh, I, I just couldn't think of what I could do in any way to enhance it, and you very uh, generously invited me to, to sing it as a duet. Um, which I think turned out pretty pretty darn well. I think it adds to it a lot. Yeah, and uh, we were talking earlier about if the record has a theme, if and if, uh, if pressed on that point, I would say, I think mortality and legacy. Um, you know, it's all over this record: birth and death, and the passing down of uh, of things through the generations, which is a appropriate song fodder for a couple of middle-aged guys, don't you think? Fair enough. Fair <laughs> enough. So uh, there we go. That's the last track on Almost Paradigm. Thank you for hanging with us. And uh, if you're inspired by any of this, uh, go out and check it out. And if you have already heard the songs, we hope we haven't ruined any of them for you. Yeah, forget what we said. Yeah, yeah. it's, it's your interpretation that matters, really. All, all art is in the eyes and ears and uh, sometimes nose of the beholder. I was thinking the exact same thing you were thinking yeah. when you heard it. Yeah. All right. That I can't change because I traded them